Now I'm going to show you the progress Winslow's made while yielding his hind quarters. So I'm going to change it up a little bit. He's made good progress, um, and he will yield both sides, crossing his feet over three times in a row, which is what I count as like successful. He knows the lesson here. He's got it down. So I'm just going to add in my dressage whip, or he needs a riding crap, but the, the whip I'm going to use when I ride him is going to just connect more of the groundwork to the ridden work. So I'm going to do the same thing. And this is just going to be in place of my leg rope. So I'm come up here, then step for it, tap. And he's moving off a lot better, a lot quicker response. Did it three times in a row, I didn't have to tap. So he pretty much does it. And I would just practice that occasionally. Do it, kind of incorporate it into your everyday work. So when you're putting in the wash rack, when you're grooming and putting in the stall, putting in the pasture, stuff like that. And then if he gets worse while he's riding, doesn't want to move him around, then I go back to the groundwork and do him again. Let's do it on his other side. Come over. I'm going to move a little bit quicker on this side. He's being kind of lazy, and he's a little lazy under saddle, so I want to balance that out on the ground. lot better at the healing the hindquarters um, so he'll it'll transfer over to your underside work.